Hey guys, welcome to Tech Notebook, and today I'm going to be showing you how to connect your Raspberry Pi to your Windows PC. This is done by using an SSH client called Putty. More on that in a bit. By the way, please pardon my muffled voice as I do have a slight cold. The first thing we want to do is to make sure that Raspbian is installed on the Raspberry Pi. You also want to make sure that you have connected the Pi to Ethernet or configured the Wi-Fi. Then you need to hover over the Raspberry icon on the top left, and then go down into Preferences, and click on Raspberry Pi Configuration. Once you have, you need to click on Interfaces at the top and click on the Enable dot corresponding to SSH and then click OK. After this, you want to open up a terminal window and type in hostname space hyphen i as shown at the top of your screen. That will show you your IP address. It'll start with 192.168 and then it'll have two numbers following this. An example of this would be 192.168.0.104. So, once you have gotten your IP address, you will want to jot it down. Now, you want to go to your Windows PC and enter the link that is shown at the top of your screen. https colon slash slash tinyurl.com slash tn hyphen putty. Then, you need to download the 62-bit or 32-bit file depending on your operating system. You will then need to go to all the setup and open the application which will have an interface like the one shown. In the part that says hosting, you need to enter the IP address you noted down. Then you need to click open. That will take you to the login page where it will ask you for a username and password. Assuming you didn't change anything, the default username is pi and the default password is raspberry. Nothing is capital. Now you should be taken to the command prompt where you can control the raspberry pi. You have now set up your SSH connection to the Raspberry Pi. Okay guys, that's the end of this tutorial. Thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.